everyone. Today we're going to tune the truck with a trifecta tune. We'll test and see if you lose any mile per gallon with this tune. Then we'll have a little fun and test the power gains. In the box, you don't get anything fancy. You just get this plug that plugs your computer into your OBD2 port of your truck. They do include a license plate cover and some cool stickers that we might install. All right, let's get started by getting a baseline mile per gallon. We're gonna fill the truck until the pump stops, then wait 30 seconds and top off one more time. All right, for this mile per gallon test, the speed limit is 55 miles an hour and it's a little over a 40 mile loop. Right now we're doing the stock test run before the tune to get a baseline. All right, right on the Trifecta website, it says it's their mission to bring the best of your late model General Motors vehicle, whether it's your prize project car or grocery getter. Now they go with a calibration first approach. And what does that really mean? That means they try to get everything out of your vehicle by just using the software. That doesn't mean that you can't do your small bolt-ons like a cold air intake or an exhaust. All right, checking back in with the gauges here. It says we're getting 17 miles per gallon at around the 15 mile mark. As you can see, this loop is outside of town. There's not a lot of traffic, but there are a lot of hills. It's really the most realistic driving that you'll find around here in Alaska. There aren't too many areas that you can go out and test a 40 or 50 mile loop that's perfectly flat. All right, here we are at the turnaround point and we're showing over just over 16 miles per gallon. There's a big reason for the drop in mile per gallon is right up to this turnaround point, there's a big, big hill that you have to climb. All right, let's get turned around here and then get back to the gas station and see what we've got. Don't forget that a little later in the video, we're gonna show you the performance gains. Here we are, 41.7 miles and 18.6 mile per gallon. Let's see what it says at the pump. We've already pumped. Here is the second click. Let's see what we've got. 2.254 gallons, all right. All right, we had 41.7 miles divided by 2.254 gallons. 18 and a half gallons. It's pretty decent. That's about what I expected. All right, now let's get back home and uh, hook the laptop up and get this thing tuned. Quick safety note here is this video is sped up. I'm not driving this fast through a neighborhood. All right, so you'll sign on to the Trifecta website. You'll go to downloads, and then this is the guide. It shows you here. This shows you exactly what it's gonna look like, where it says last name, first name. That's your actual tune download. So let's try it out. First, let's download the Easy Flash. All right, this area is sped up, but in real time, it takes about five minutes to install. Remember, we're in Fairbanks, Alaska, so we're working off of like 1980s internet speed, so it's probably gonna be a lot faster where you are. Boom, there we go, we're all done. Now we'll just go up to Program, take a look at the tunes that are available. As you can see, there are zero tunes in here. I just wanted to show you this real quick so you don't make the same mistake. I bought the tune months ago, but I just haven't had a chance to get around to doing the video and doing the installation. So I never took the time to log in and see if there were any notifications in my account. So it's supposed to look like this with your last name and first name, and that's the tunes that you have. Mine looks like this with just the user guide and the easy flash, no tunes. So when I actually realized there was a notification up there, I clicked on it and they were requesting more information. So I actually had to plug into the vehicle and pull data out of the vehicle, security codes for the transmission and the engine, and then send it back to them. This is apparently required for any 2017 model or above. I reached out to Trifecta, told them what happened, sent them the information that they were requesting, and within 24 hours, they knocked it out. I got a notification saying that I'd received the tunes within three to five business days because they're built specific for your vehicle, uh, but they actually got them to me within 24 hours. They were really awesome. The whole situation was totally my fault, but they really jumped through hoops and made it happen. 
the install is really straightforward and really simple. Just follow the directions on your computer and you're done. All right, we're back at the pump and we're ready to finish this fuel economy test. Let's take a quick break from fuel economy and let's go have some fun and test out the power gains. All right, we tested this little app called Race Timer. No, it doesn't give completely accurate quarter mile times because it doesn't take into account reaction times and all that. But it is a fun app to use and it will show improvements in performance. All right, let's check it out. All right, first we'll show three runs without the tune, then we'll show three runs after tuning. This quarter mile time was 10.9 and our average was 11.16. Alright, best time is 9.1 with an average time of 9.46. Alright, back to fuel economy. Here we are topping off the truck. That's the second pump. We'll get started. Cruise is set at 55, let's see what we get. Right now the computer is actually showing that we're getting better fuel mileage. Check it out, since putting 33s on this truck, I've rarely seen it go into V4 mode. So check it out, with a trifecta tune, there's three ways that you can roll. You can go in sport mode, that's 28 wheel horsepower and 41 foot-pounds of torque. You go into sport mode by turning the cruise control off. Now when you arm the cruise control or set the cruise control, then you're in stock or economy mode. This gives economy-centric pedal response and shift points. So what does that mean in the real world? We chose to keep the active fuel management or V4 mode, four cylinder mode. I almost decided to have it completely eliminated. After putting 33 inch tires on the truck, we never even see it go into V4 mode anymore. Since installing the tune, I've seen it go into V4 mode more often than it ever has the entire time we've owned the truck. Some people say that they get a really bad drone from the four-cylinder mode when they have an exhaust system installed. The only time we've experienced a really bad drone is when we're towing uphill with a really heavy trailer. That brings us to the third profile, tow haul mode. When tow haul mode is selected on your vehicle, it offers the factory tow haul mode. This is the optimum setting to use when towing. See, four cylinder mode again. So the computer's actually reading better, but let's see what the actual pump says. I'm really curious to see the results because it's been running in four cylinder mode a lot more often. So last time the computer was really accurate, that puts it right around 20 miles per gallon. That would just be awesome. Oh, no way. All right, that's 41.6 divided by 1.790. 23.24, wow, I was that really, really shocked me. All right, I've got a little bonus for you guys. I'm gonna do the test one more time real quick in sport mode to see what we get then. Here's where we're at almost halfway. Here we are, almost finished. Again, you just saw there, V4 mode again. All right, what do you guys think? That's 28 horsepower and 41 foot-pounds of torque. You think we got better or worse than stock? Here we go, first pump. Now wait 30 seconds. Pump again, here we go. All right, 41.6. Divided by 1.887. No way. That's a three and a half mile per gallon increase with a horsepower and torque gain. All right, my thoughts. For the price, this tune is absolutely incredible. Power and performance, the throttle response is really crisp. The tune really wakes the engine up. It's performance you can really feel. Now with fuel economy, yeah sure, if you set it the cruise control at 55 and you're just barely cruising around, you're gonna see an improvement. The problem is, the truck is so much more fun to drive, it's gonna be really, really hard to keep your foot out of the gas. I just wanna say I'm not affiliated with Trifecta Performance, but this tune is definitely worth it. 
Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. It really helps us out.